Hi. Hi, everybody. <clears throat> How are you? It's Monday, magical Monday, but guess what? I am feeling a little bit like it's Mix It Up Monday, but thanks for joining me again. Um, it's been a great weekend in South Georgia. I actually had some really nice rain. Uh, got a lot of things done here at the homestead and um, lots of fresh veggies um, harvested. And um, gosh, it was just a really nice, it was a really nice weekend to, to daydream and um, not start anything new, but kind of tie up some loose ends and things. And um get ready, prepare for the new moon. Oh my gosh, there's a major shift um, going to happen um, this week. Uh, the new moon occurs Thursday and also a solar eclipse. So we'll get to that the rest of the week. So, but thanks for joining the Daily Dose of Dirt today. I am the blonde wise woman. And yeah, I woke up this morning and it's just that mix it up Monday. Let me explain. So I am, I am a very much a creature of habit and um, I love to stick to my routine. I love to stick to my routine like um, double stick tape, duct tape or gorilla tape. I mean, I'm, you know, you, you can count on what, what time and what I'm doing um, pretty much. But truth be told, my double stick tape, um, you know how it, after a while, you need to replace it because it's just not sticking very good? Yeah, well, mine needs to be changed. Um, and it is a good thing that I woke up this morning and a cosmic signpost pointed me to a new role and said, hey, let's change things up. Do something fresh. So the moon stays in earthy Taurus today. And um, so that'll keep us grounded and stable. And that's really good for um, a magical Monday. And so it also aligns with liberating Uranus. Um, Uranus is that planet that, you know, just resonates with a little bit of rebellious um, energy, liberation, freedom, you know, mix it up, mix it up. So, and then Saturn encourages, encourages us to, to change up our routine too, but keep it within boundaries, be responsible about it. So that's good. So I encourage us to, you know what, try refreshing, try a refreshing approach to conquer this Monday, even if it takes a few rolls of tape to make it stick, you know? So they say that um, to, to set a routine in place, you've got to do it a couple of times, you know? Um, sometimes if I want to remember something, I just repeat it over and over in my head. But that's a whole nother session there to talk about my issues. <laughs> so, um, so come on, let's just mix it up. Mix it up on Monday. Let's keep things interesting. Keep it different. Um, keep the magic in the mundane. Yeah, be truthful. What is monotonous? I'm, I'm, I don't, I like monotony. It's fine. Except as long as it's not a monotonous noise, kind of like the air conditioning unit over here making this noise right now. Yeah, that's the monotonous noise. I don't like, but monotony and mundane, I, I'm okay with that. I'm okay. But sometimes it does get tiresome and maybe it's not serving you the way it needs to be. So um, I drew an archetype card for this Mix It Up Monday and it kind of, you know, sticks the dirt to us. Um, it was the um, Alethea um, and it's from the initiation section of the deck. And basically, it is the truth card. The truth. It's black and white. And um, it simply states the truth. The truth. We're all familiar with the cliche. The truth will set you free. True. No doubt. Very true. Okay. But um, when the truth is spoken, and I've always said, and this is true too, 
words are so powerful. Choose your words wisely. Choose your words wisely because there's so much power within words. And we recognize truth within ourselves. A revelation. Truth, it opens the doors of opportunity to alter our destiny, uncover what is hidden along our path, and it actually it opens our eyes to move forward in a new light. But this morning I was kind of thinking, you know, the truth, we consider this with me, the truth. Consider this. Consider this with me. What about if we thought about the idea? What about if we thought about the idea of setting the truth free instead of it setting us free? Let the truth spread wings and fly. It could prove to be positively contagious. This card, the truth card, it beckons. It beckons to set our truth free. So these were the questions I'm pondering today, and I encourage you to ponder these questions too. What, what is keeping your truth in the dark? What is holding you back? What path are you maintaining just for the sake of maintaining? And what lies do you keep telling yourself? What lies do you keep believing and telling yourself over and over again? And what are your fears if you set your truth free? What are you afraid of? Just let it fly. Let the truth soar. It is contagious. It is contagious. And if it's free, then you are free. I am free. And the moon, the new moon, oh, she is fast approaching. She is waning down. And it is time to liberate. Liberate yourself flaunt your flag of truth and allow your path to unfold. Even if it, it takes a little bit of a detour to grab a new roll of fresh tape and get a new routine going, approach things a little differently, not start anything new. This is not the time to start anything significantly new. We've got some intense oh, shifts happening, and but it is a ready, set, go time to mix it up, mix what you started, the last new moon. By now, you know what's working and what's not working. Be honest with yourself. Set your truth free. Go ahead and take care of all of that. Dig deep. Stay grounded. That Taurus moon will help us to do that. Tend your garden. And when I say tend, I love to tend my garden, but I like to tend myself too. And it's necessary. Tend your path. Clear obstacles. Go to that closet. Go to your broom closet. Get that broom out. Sweep away. What isn't serving you? And whatever is serving you, the truth, your truth, claim it. Claim that truth and let it fly. Let it just. It is mix it up Monday. And when the cosmos throws up some signposts that says, hey, let's do things different. Let's go with it. Go with it. So I hope that you guys, this is Monday. It's a kick off the week kind of day. It's magical, even in the mundane. I will see you here tomorrow. Um, check out medium.com, the craft and chrome. And gosh, I'd love to have you join my broom closet on the craft and chrome with patreon.com. So that would be awesome. So because tomorrow for Patreons is terrific, thrilling Tarot Tuesday. So yes, I will be posting a 
exclusive tarot reading for patrons only. So if you aren't subscribing, it is more than a subscription. It's an exclusive room closet and you get to join the journey and share all kinds of stuff. Um, and um, the more patrons we have, the more fun we have the more opportunity to have fun, the more opportunity to share our path, our journeys together and support one another. Gosh, I'd like that a lot. So the Craft and Chrome, patreon.com. Go ahead, subscribe, and um, then you can join us for uh, Tuesday's tarot card reading. And um, here, I'll go ahead and um, this is the link here. Uh, I'll yeah, there's the, the link here so you can go to um, your Daily Dose of Dirt here, the Craft and Crone on Patreon.com. Yay. And um, have a magical Monday. And I'll see you here again tomorrow. I do a live Daily Dose of Dirt Monday through Friday. See you tomorrow.